Hi everyone, my name is Angie. I'm a Senior Assistant Director with the USC Viterbi School of Engineering. And today we have a quick video for you about applying to USC as a transfer student. But before we get started, I'll have my colleagues introduce themselves. Stacey, do you wanna go first? Absolutely. So hello, my name is Stacey Badger. Um, I'm the Assistant Director of Undergraduate Admission for USC Viterbi. So happy to, to talk to our transfer students today. And I'm Michael Cox. I'm also the Assistant Director of Undergraduate Admission here at Viterbi. Thanks so much for joining us. Awesome. So if you are a transfer student looking to apply to engineering or computer science, you are in the right place. This is a short video that is all about navigating the Common App, selecting your major, and some other frequently asked questions that, that you might have. And the reason why we're doing this is because we often get asked by students, how do I apply to the Viterbi School? What do I need to submit to be considered for engineering? And this short video is going to show you exactly what you need to do. So there's no specific Viterbi School application. Everything you need to do is in the common application, which is what we're going to be going over today. So the first thing you wanna do is make sure that you have created an account with the common application. Uh, we are on a testing environment, so your application may look a little bit different when it's live, um, but it shouldn't look drastically different that this video is not helpful. Um, if you applied to USC as a first year student, you may not be able to create an account with the same email address that you used in the first year application. So just make sure that if you aren't able to create an account, it may be because you're repeating an email that you've already used. So make sure to have a new email address um, with the Transfer Common App. In order to add USC onto the Common Application, you want to go to Add Program tab here and you can look up USC by typing in USC and you'll see USC transfer fall appear and you can add the applicate you can add USC to your application by clicking on this little plus sign here uh, we want to emphasize throughout this video that the transfer deadline has changed um, it will not be February 15th 2022 that is when the transfer application is due so once you've added USC here you can go back to the my application tab and access uh, the USC supplement through program materials here. Awesome, so the first thing you wanna do uh, with the USC supplement is select a Viterbi major. Um, so in order to select that Viterbi major, you're gonna go to program materials and you're gonna select USC transfer fall. Um, and then you're gonna wanna go to the questions tab and scroll down to academics. And then you're going to want to pick any major that has a VSE prefix in front of it. So VSE stands for the Viterbi School of Engineering. So this is all of our Viterbi majors, and this includes our computer science major as well. So in order for us to see your application, uh, we do need to be your first choice major. Um, we cannot see any applications that we are the second choice major for. So definitely make sure you put for, put us as your first choice major. And then we always recommend putting something outside of engineering as your second choice major. And then once you've selected a Viterbi major, the writing supplement will auto-populate our Viterbi specific questions. You can confirm this by going to the writing supplement section. So just scroll on down there. Then the Viterbi questions are going to be found toward the bottom of the page and are titled Your Unique Contributions to USC Viterbi and the Engineering Grand Challenges. If you don't see these questions, don't panic. Just scroll right back up to academics. Make sure that you've selected a Viterbi major. You may need to click save and refresh the page if you have already selected a Viterbi major and don't see our supplemental questions. So we often get questions about certain majors that you may or may not find on the common application. So we want to address them. Um, we often get questions about data science as a major. And when you're looking at the majors, you actually won't find data science on the common application. Data science is not a major available to transfer students, and it is only available to current USC students. So if you are interested in learning more about data science, you can contact the Dornsife College of Letters, Arts, and Sciences. They are the USC unit responsible for managing data science. The other question we get often about is the physics and computer science major. Um, it's going to be down here, and it also starts with DLAS, 
What that means is that it's also a major run by the Dornsife College of Letters, Arts and Sciences. If you select this major as your first choice major, we will not consider you for admission to the Viterbi School of Engineering. So just to re-emphasize, you wanna make sure that you're choosing a major that starts with VSC. Other questions that we get about the common application are about uploading transcripts. So sometimes students want to upload their transcripts into my documents. You don't need to upload any transcripts through the common application. However, you can send your official transcripts to the common application and the common application will share your official transcripts with all of the institutions that you are applying for. Um, if you don't plan to send your transcripts that way, you do need to send them directly to USC and we'll share some information on how to do that. Um, what you do need to do here in the document section is make sure that you let us know what courses you have planned or in progress for the remainder of the school year. So for fall 2021 and spring 2022. If you're on a quarter system or taking winter classes, make sure you include those as well in this document. This document doesn't have to be official. It can just be a PDF where you write what you have planned or in progress. So if you are not sending your transcripts to the common application, you can send them to USC um, by either mailing them here to our address or by sending them electronically. Electronically might be the easiest way for you to send your documents to USC. All right, I'll hand it back over to Stacy. All right, so overall, a complete application to apply to USC Viterbi. Uh, what that would include is it includes the Common App, it, inclu it includes your USC supplement, your official high school transcripts. Um, don't worry, the high school transcripts are just to make sure that you graduated from high school. We do not use them in terms of admission um, and, like, and making decisions, so we won't care about your grades or anything like that. We just want to make sure that you finished high school. Uh, we also need your transcripts from whatever institutions that you attended. Um, that includes every institution you attended, regardless of when you attended it. So we need all of those, all of those transcripts. Um, if you are seeking admission for a second bachelor's degree, um, you do not need to send those high school transcripts. Um, but if you did, if you did not receive a high school diploma, you do need to submit your official copy of your GED um, with a letter of explanation. And if you want to be considered for merit scholarships, all you have to do is apply by the final deadline of February 15th. Transfer students only have one application deadline, which is the 15th of February uh, in the same year for the term to which you are applying. There is no separate scholarship application. So as long as you apply by the deadline, you will be considered for merit scholarships. If you have any other questions about applying to USC as a transfer student or anything else, feel free to reach out to us via email, vadmit at usc.edu. And um, we also strongly encourage you to take a look at our website, viterbiadmission.usc.edu forward slash transfer to read more about our specific transfer requirements and our course recommendations by major. We also have our other contact information here. You can contact us by phone by either calling us or texting us. Um, otherwise, we look forward to reading your application. Good luck and fight on.